I hear all this, you know, well, this is class warfare, this is whatever. No. There is nobody in this country who got rich on his own. Nobody. If you've been successful, you, don't, you didn't get there on your own. You, you didn't get there on your own. You built a factory out there. Good for you. If you've been successful, you, don't, you didn't get there on your own. But I want to be clear. You moved your goods to market on the roads the rest of us paid for. Somebody invested in roads and bridges. If you got a business, that, you didn't build that. Somebody else made that happen. You hired workers. The rest of us paid to educate. If you were successful, somebody along the line gave you some help. There was a great teacher somewhere in your life. You uh, were safe in your factory because of police forces and fire forces that the rest of us paid for. You, you didn't get there on your own. I, I'm always struck by people who think, well, it must be because I was just so smart. There are a lot of smart people out there. You didn't have to worry that marauding bands would come and seize everything at your factory and hire someone to protect against this because of the work the rest of us did. It must be because I worked harder than everybody else. Let me tell you something. There are a whole bunch of hard-working people out there. Now look, you built a factory and it turned into something terrific or a great idea. God bless. Keep a big hunk of it. But part of the underlying social contract is you take a hunk of that and pay forward for the next kid who comes along. Somebody helped to create this unbelievable American system that we had that allowed you to thrive. The internet didn't get invented on its own. This is absolute lunacy, as are most progressive socialist ideals. My parents paid for my teachers and the roads and the police and the firemen when I was a kid, as did their parents when they were kids. Now I pay for the teachers and the roads and the police and the fire and all of the other services that these two socialists may wish to include. All of those people were compensated for conducting their duties as they were hired to do. ...owns a thing that I create, not one. What I create is mine. What they create is theirs. And if any of these boobs have one of Obama's newly created overcompensated government jobs and thereby create nothing, that's their problem. How dare you try to make it mine?